Five Jacksonville State University held its annual active shooter training today. It's something they hope they will never have to use. The law enforcement simulating that mass shooting at a sporting event. Our East Alabama reporter Reggie Kyle inside the witnesses and live at five with what he saw, Reggie. Jonathan, they say it's being prepared but expecting the worst. That's how law enforcement officials describe the chaos they presented this morning. Jacksonville State University hosted a large scale emergency training exercise this morning in the Pete Matthews Coliseum. First responders and students practiced responding to an active shooter at a sporting event. So as athletic trainers, I mean, we have to respond to the event and basically get people out the way, make sure the scene is safe, and then we handle the situation after, after the scene is safe. This pre-planned emergency situation brought students in nursing, social work, emergency management and athletic training to respond to a shooting scenario acted out by university theater students. This is uh, an event that's been going on for three years now and it started out with five faculty that were planning this. We really wanted to, to really uh, develop this plan because it's so important to all the different disciplines that are involved and uh, they are going to have to at some point possibly uh, address a situation like this. JSU leaders say they plan to continue this type of training while looking at other settings to see how they can offer the same level of training in a variety of areas and experiences. It has been a great positive response all the way from President Killingsworth to our faculty, our athletic, uh, our athletic department has all also supported this. It definitely is being proactive because we want our students to be, be prepared as they go out into the career, into their now, JSU officials say they hope none of this training is ever used. This is the third simulated training, and they're planning more in the future. In Jacksonville, Reggie Kyle, WBRC, Fox 6 News, on your side.